Hey everybody, Joe from Home Crush here. I've got a short little video today to review a product that's only of interest to a select few. But if you're one of those people, you're gonna like it. Who am I talking about? Well, owners of the Port Keys LI, or LI2, or LISDI. The LI is a budget-friendly electronic viewfinder with most of the features Port Keys includes in their great on-camera monitors, like LUT support, guides, false color, peaking, etc but it's designed to be used right up against your eye, complete with an optical diopter. And at $400, you get all of that for less than half what competing EVFs cost. Now, I picked up the original version about two years ago, and I love it. If you shoot shoulder mount, and if you don't, what's wrong with you? Why, what are you, stupid? What's the matter with you? I apologize. What's the matter with you? Then you really should check it out. EVFs give you both a distraction-free view of your scene and provide another point of contact to steady your shot. But this video isn't really about the LI. No, it's about a new eye cup for the LI. See, the LI comes out of the box with only this super cheap foam to rest against your delicate little cheekbones. An eye cup's job is just to provide a light, tight seal and a little cushion, and honestly, even this junky little piece of foam does that well enough. But after a couple of years of use, mine is getting pretty ragged. And I'm pretty gentle with it. I'll bet many other users have destroyed more than one by now. So when Portkeys announced an upgraded replacement for 20 bucks, I ordered it right away. Even if the shipping from China literally doubled the price. Essentially, it's the same foam donut, but wrapped in thin fake leatherette. And it's got this lovely branding on the cover. You have to take it off to stow the cover away, so you're gonna lose it instantly. Oh well. So, it looks nicer, but is it actually any better? Well, yeah, actually it is. It's softer, smoother, and it does a slightly better job making a seal against your face. So it blocks outside light better. Now, as you'd expect, the fake leather can get sweaty in the heat, but at least unlike the foam version, it, you can wipe it down. Just don't expect the new eye cup to hold up to much abuse. The fake leather is really thin, and it seems like it would easily cut or tear. So was this 20, actually $40 well spent? I think so. It's just a small improvement over the old version, but if you're gonna have something up against your face for an entire shoot, it might as well be something comfortable, right? Now, as an owner of the original LI, it's a welcome upgrade. I hope Port Keys begins including this new version with all new LI shipments. Because if I bought a new LI without it, knowing the new eye cup was available, I'd be kind of pissed. Yeah, I just made an entire video about an eye cup. But then again, you just watched an entire video about an eye cup. Maybe both of us should just get out there and crush it. 